relies heavily on completing the life cycle of the animal that you're researching. We're on Bull Island. I woke Billy up this morning to go work out. He was very resistant. It's pre-coffee right now. Pre-breakfast as well. We're just doing our warm up. Gonna get a little land workout in while we can. Almost done. Going into Woods Hall right now. We're gonna do some work on computer at the local coffee shop. Go and to the Oceanographic Institution. And then grab some provisions from the food store. And then cruise back to the boat. We're gonna explore Woods Hall a little bit. Here you go. Eel ponds now. Ah. I love all these little skiffs. So right, right now, the, these are primarily our display species, so we're doing a lot of outreach and uh, public display okay. um, so people can understand what we're doing. And what we want to do is create a new model organism, so it's like a mouse and a fruit fly. Um, for a lot of genetics research, um, embryology, neurobiology, kind of branches out to everything. Um, but a lot of the grants and a lot of the funding for the research relies heavily on completing the life cycle of the animal that you're researching. Okay. So we'll do like a What's blind, the craziest color you've seen them do? Um, this guy, it's actually not too many colorations. Uh, it's mostly stripe patterns, white. You can see the bilateral display uh -huh. right now. So they got white on one side, dark on the other. They could actually, they have uh, different structures all over their body. So this is our main ambassador for our research here. Oh, there he is. Oh, well, those are the adults. So that's a max size for, for a male.
Go get Daddy. Where is she? Go. You're looking for the horses. She's right there. <laughs> They're growling at each other. <laughs> Daddy, you're being a brat. That was Marlin's stick. You are such a brat. Marlin, get it. Get it from her. Go get her. your branch, Marlin. You Marlin, are mean. She's like, I don't even like you in branches. I'm, I'm just going to do it to make him mad. Marlon, you want to come up here? You want to come up here? Smell? Am I making sparks? No. It smells like. Hey, Marlon, look at me. What was that? Three, two, one. Come here, doggies! everybody Good we just left Hadley Harbor we were anchored there for a couple days because we were having really hard southwest wind like 20 to 30 knots for two days and we woke up this morning it was completely calm just glass so we started cruising and right now we are in Buzzards Bay so we are about 30 maybe 35 miles away from Newport We'll have a small current with us and hopefully we get there in like maybe five hours from now. It'd be nice. at the mouth of Buzzards Bay right now just getting into the ocean so we have Cuddy Hunk off our port side the mainland right behind us here or off our starboard side still no wind glassy calm except for some ocean swell we're starting to catch now so getting a little bit rolly right off our port bow not too bad maybe one to three foot swell we're going pretty fast, going six to seven knots with the current. We're about 15 miles away from turning into Newport Harbor. Not many boats on the water today, just a few fishing boats here and there. Seal popping up here and there. Sierra's asleep downstairs. Dogs are just laying down. to round up into Newport Harbor. We have Brenton Point right here behind me. The big sailing regatta going on off of our port side. Jetty and Sierra hanging out. Where's Marlin? There he is. What do you think of Newport so far? I don't know. We're not there yet. They say Newport is the sailing capital of the world. Lots of big fancy cool sailboats. Seaside town. Good seafood. Did we tell them already what we're doing in Newport while we're here? You tell. Somebody's looking at the boat tomorrow. So there's a chance that we could be packing up all our stuff in a rental van or something. Neverland staying here. <laughs> kind of weird saying that out loud. Crazy. We'll see what happens.
the guy who's looking at the boat tomorrow, he actually owns a mooring company out here and he's hooking us up with the mooring while we stay here in Newport, which is awesome. So we're just following Neil over to the mooring now. Okay. Can you just tell them what you just told me? I'm gonna get insulted if these people don't like our boat. I've put in many hours of work and sanding and painting and Varnishing cleaning and, and cleaning and <laughs> <laughs> We're going into town right now, to Newport. To get some lobster. Lobster. Where do you say it was? Such cool boats around here. Super unique, like Really nice, cool boats. Check this one out right here.